Rangers have agreed a deal worth up to four million to sign defender Ben Davies from Liverpool. No, it's no Ben Davies, the Welsh international. It's Ben Davies, the jobber that plays for Liverpool. I'm not happy with this, right? This is fucking shite business. And see everyone that's putting on Twitter. I, 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 who was it? Was it Loyal Blues Loyal or some Trust Blues Loyal? I don't know. They put up something about... Oh, he dominated the SPFL, he made a Europa League final, he won the league, he won the Scottish Cup, we've made 22 million from him, are he's raging? What sort of fucking logic is this guy under? Are he's raging? Obviously referring to Celtic fans, we've lost one of our best players from last season, doesn't matter how much it's fucking for, obviously making 20 million is better than zero, but like see back in the day when Thierry Henry left Arsenal to go to Barcelona. Did Arsene Fenger come out and... Or did any Arsenal fans come out and say, I will get it right up, you Sir Alex, man. Look at all those trophies that he won against you and that's him away for a fee. No, that's small club mentality. Oh, we've made a bit of money on our... Oh, we've made 40 million, including all the add-ons on two players. Get it up, you Celtic. You know what? Obviously, Scottish football, financially, like... When you do make a bit of money like that, it is good. But let's not pretend it's a fucking great scenario. Aye, we've made a bit of money. But we should have made more from Bassi and we should have made more from Aribo. So it's hardly the fucking greatest scenario ever. We've lost two of our best players from last season. Right? The team is significantly weaker without those two. Don't give a fuck what anybody says it is. So see these people trying to claim that we're in a better place and we're doing fantastic because we sold those two and that Celtic should be raging. And they're putting that meme up from only an excuse of the Celtic fan crying. See when Celtic sold Kieran Tierney, I looked at it two ways. Fuck, that's made Celtic a decent bit of money. and uh, But they've also lost a very good player in Kieran Tierney. Was any Rangers fans greeting about the fact that Kieran Tierney had left Celtic? I don't think so. So why the fuck would any Celtic fans be greeting or be completely greeting about it? If anything, Celtic fans would be like, I know Rangers made quite a bit of money from those uh, Bassi and Aribo deals, but hey, they've lost two of their best players. I think that's it, a completely idiotic stance to take on it, and it's pathetic. It's, it's actually embarrassing, to be honest, to have that fucking opinion. You know, like, you just wouldn't get that. You, you just do not get that from anything. You know, oh, you, you're raging, look at the amount of money. We make, what? what? Like, uh, it's embarrassing. Like, everyone needs to stop that. It. It's fucking horrendous. But talking about horrendous, Rangers agree £4 million to sign Ben Davies, who they signed from Preston for 500000 Um, He made... He, he hasn't even made... An appearance for Liverpool, and he was on loan at Sheffield United last season. This is an absolute horrendous deal. I don't care what anybody says. Oh, I'll give him a chance, man. He's put the shirt on. Couldn't give a fuck. It's pish. This ain't good, right? Anyone could see see this for it is. I mean, look at look at Ange, right? He actually goes into the Japanese market, right? We all thought they were jobbers, right? But I'd rather sign a bunch of unknown players rather than someone who we know is shite. We're literally just paying four million for a guy who's from the Premier League and he's English. That's it. This guy's pish. Not good enough for Rangers. No, no, no. Kiss goodbye to anything in Europe with this guy in the fucking back of your team, man. That's the bottom line. This is a pish deal. Run over. Anyone putting that pish up a bit. Oh, man, we've made money. Huh? I'm sorry, right? Making 30 million. I'm not, I'm not factoring in add-ons, right? But making like 30 million from our two best players from last season and losing them is not good. Right? No Celtic fan is greeting. Maybe tears of joy, but not greeting.